Hey, it's Mr. Hodkop here. Very excited to talk to you about a mountain that Gilbert and I are going to be climbing, Pico de Orizaba. Pico de Orizaba is 18,491 feet, so it's pretty big and we're very excited to climb it. It is significant for several reasons. One of those, it's the highest volcano in Mexico. It's also the highest volcano in all of North America. It is the second highest volcano in prominence in the world, second only to the one that Gilbert climbed earlier, Mount Kilimanjaro. And it is also the third highest peak in all of North America. Let's go to the sandbox and take a look at some of the ge geology of this volcano, Pico de Orizaba. Pico de Orizaba is a dormant volcano but it's not extinct. It erupts approximately every 100 years, and the last time that it erupted was 1848. So we're just a little bit sketchy about this, a little bit scared. Pico de Orizaba was formed in what is known as the Trans-Mexican Volcanic Belt. And it's a string of volcanoes that go all the way across Mexico from the Caribbean to the Pacific coast and there's more than 20 volcanoes in Mexico. These volcanoes are likely to be produced when the oceanic crust, the Cocos Plate, gets subducted underneath this North American plate, the continental crust. Here, let me grab two rocks and show you. Here we have felsic material made of aluminum that has very low density, so it floats up on top. Here we have more basaltic, oceanic crust, and here's the continental crust. When this cocos plate hits that continental plate, this floats up on top and this oceanic crust gets subducted underneath. Now obviously when it does this, it starts to heat up all the rocks underneath. And then that liquidot magma slowly works its way up the continental crust. When it eventually gets to the surface like Pico de Orizaba, and BAM! You have a great big explosion. Pico de Orizaba is a stratovolcano, a volcano of alternating layers. So there is layers of magma flow and then layer of tephra debris on it. Pico de Orizaba also has nine glaciers that Gilbert and I are going to be climbing. One specific glacier in the northwest corner called the Jamba Glacier. Hey, I hope I I hope I explained to you guys a little bit of that geology, this Pico de Orizaba that we're going to be climbing. We'll talk to you later.